So I'm gonna go home. Um, just finishing work. It's six six eleven a.m. And I'm gonna trade New York. I traded a bit in London. I lost, but everything ran at two o'clock. So I just kind of dipped out on that. So now I will show you guys what I'm trading. I'm kind of watching Euro US, Euro Canadian, GJ, so pound, yen, Canadian yen, and USD Canadian, I think. Um, so I will head home and I'll show you that. So as you can see here, this is Euro GP. Um, I'm just kind of going through the charts and seeing what i can trade and what's decent to trade this is in trading view so i have some uh, indicators there um, i just kind of like cycle through a couple of my uh, favorite pairs so euro pound and i'm looking at an rsi 100 and rsi 25 there so when they cross over um when one line pink or black um black's 100 pink is 25 when the black line crosses down you sell when the pink line crosses up you buy um, it's kind of easy, like it's it's not perfect, but you do have to kind of look at the long-term trend. Um, so now I'm looking at Canadian yen. This is another good one, um, good time to trade in Tokyo. And as well in um, New York, it, it seems to do okay. Um, then again, sometimes everything can just run at the same time. And as you see, I have $517 there. So this is a live account, this is not a demo. My broker is forex.com. Um, I'm not sponsored or anything by them. This is just the broker I use. I kind of want to see what Oanda or o o -N yeah, o -A -N -D -A has to offer um, as far as spreads and like a leverage and stuff like that. I think I'm at a pretty low leverage because I'm new and I only started with $100. I did put in another $400, so I'm still kind of struggling to make a profit. Um, I win some, I lose some. But for every couple I win, I lose. So it's kind of going up and down but I am getting there. Um, so this is um, pretty much what I do every morning. Uh, 7.30, I start looking at the charts. I do work midnight, so I trade a bit of London from two or well, 3 a.m. till 5 or 6 a.m. Uh, Eastern Standard Time, and then I uh, give it a break, and then sometimes I go to the gym, uh, sometimes I don't, and then I get ready for New York around 7.30, and then I get ready to trade at 8. But then again, things are running all the time, so... You can uh, be trading all the time. I wouldn't ad uh, advise it because technically, like for uh, people in Toronto, like me, Eastern Standard Time, you could trade Tokyo at 7 p.m. on like Sunday and then keep trading to like Friday, at, like noon when everything dies pretty much. And you're just trading around the clock, which will drive you crazy. But this is GJ, pound yen. Uh, I'm just putting in some trend lines there. Uh, trying to I'm not perfect this, this is my about my fourth week for trading forex and my dad has kind of been helping me because he's been doing it for a lot of years um he's not in it right uh anymore but um he want he wanted me to get into it so I have EMA UT bot and a super trend uh indicators I'll probably do another video on those um a screen record and show you guys what I use um everything's not perfect um, but I just kind of do my best to analyze and look at the chart and kind of use the indicators and trade from there. This is Euro US, another favorite pairing of mine. And uh, I'll look it up on TradingView there. But yeah, so I'll let you guys watch the rest of it and I will uh, see you in the next one and I'll put on some music here. <laughs> 